Monday morning and thank you for joining us. I'm Becky Hillier. Your news time now is 630. Well, there is a new phone app that's goal is to fight cyberbullying all around the world and not just when it comes to children. Wake Up Montana's Stephanie Ponte joins us now live with all those details. Hi, Stephanie. Hi, Becky. We're 14 million students have been represented by schools that have already adopted the Stop It app. And founder Todd Schobel believes that he's found a way to minimize bullying when it comes to the net. We're never going to stop this global play. Bullying is never going to go away. When I was in high school, people could write stuff about you on the bathroom wall and you could just have the janitor go in and wash it away. And in the age of the internet, when people say things or, or, or put up pictures about you or your family on the internet, sometimes it lasts forever. The story of Amanda Todd, who took her life after being bullied for many years, is one of many. Yet it's a story that called people to action. It struck me rather emotionally to say the least. I just pictured a young girl in a corner all by herself trying to deal with all these issues and problems. Todd Schobel came up with Stop It, an app that allows students to anonymously report cyberbullying. They can report incidents that they see, they can take screen captures, take videos, take pictures, what have you, send in evidence within seconds. So all these things go in there, the schools have the ability to uh, manage incidents, look for trends, um, document everything that's going on during their investigation. The app also works by deterring students from posting before thinking twice. Now, Schobel and his team are already looking at expanding the app outside of the U.S., and they hope to come out with one that doesn't just cater to schools, but also to the workplace, as children are not the only victims of cyberbullying. Reporting live in Helena, Stephanie Ponte, Wake Up Montana. Thank you, Stephanie. Pretty powerful report. Thanks so much for that. The time now 